<laughs> you really told the captain it was an undercover donut mission? <laughs> hey, it worked, didn't it? Try to keep up, city boy. We both know you were there. Tell us the truth. You're running out of time to cut a deal. Bet you five bucks he comes out in the next three minutes. You're on, and when I win, you're buying the donuts. Hey, stay with me, okay? You're not getting rid of me that easy. You wish? What if you could take your characters anywhere? You sure this is still our case? Murder's murder, even on another planet. Same face, same style, same personality, whether they're in a crime drama, a sci-fi, or just a coffee shop meetup. Feels weird meeting off duty. Even cops need caffeine. And not just one consistent character, but up to three consistent characters in the same scene every time. This is multi-character generation in Design AI, and it changes the game. Another night, another mess. Yeah, but this one feels different. We've been able to design consistent characters for a while now, but now Design AI takes it to the next level with not just two consistent characters, but up to three consistent characters in a scene. First, you need to lock in their design, and then you can place them into any scene you can imagine. And they stay exactly the same from scene to scene, shot to shot. Breaking news. We're actually terrible at reading teleprompters. <laughs> Speak for yourself. <laughs> so this is what vacation feels like. Don't get used to it. The king awaits you in the great hall. Do they serve coffee? I'll take mine in a goblet. I thought castles were your thing. Uh, I adapt. Good, you're gonna need to. This is a game changer for storytellers, advertisers, and creators. No more regenerating characters and hoping they match. Now you can tell the same story with the same characters across multiple settings, keeping continuity without hours of manual tweaking. So first come into the design platform and up here we have AI character and the quick mode to be able to create a character just with a description. First you wanna just put in the character's name which in this case is detective, and then the description for the detective, which I've made and copy and paste that. Then you can choose the star you want, whether you want a cartoon or a realistic. I'm choosing design realistic version three and generate. There it is, it's done now. We've got choice of two images, choose the closer up one to use for the consistent character for the detective. And it has that lightning bolt on it to show you that it was made with the quick mode. Now I'm going to create the second character that I want to create using the same method, starting with a description and I'm going to create a female detective and I just copy and paste in the description and put in a name for the female detective as well, which was just female detect. And then you've got to choose the star you want. And of course, because I want to use these in the same scene, you can use the same again, design realistic version three and generate. And then we're going to have a choice of two images to choose from and I prefer the closer up image so I chose that one and now we have our two characters so how can we create a image like this that's on the screen with the two characters in the same scene you want to choose 16 by 9 if that's the kind of aspect ratio you want and then you want to choose the characters that you want so in here you can click the characters the female detective and I'm choosing the male detective I have both the detectives chosen in here if I wanted to choose a third character I could also click to choose a third character like I have here where I've added myself as a third character. And I'm just going to write a simple prompt here just to demonstrate this quickly and make that in 16 by 9 and generate. And you can see the task is in the queue on the right hand side of the platform. And this is the image. Three consistent characters. AI is changing the game in the video space, not only in speed of production, cost of production and capability, but also in expectations. How to make the images into video like I did at the beginning. So I used VO3 to animate these images. So you click AI video, choose the video model you want. I chose, like I said, Google VO3 fast, but you could choose any of the video models that you want here. The advantage of VO3 fast is that you can obviously give it dialogue to speak. I made a prompt here that includes the dialogue and I click generate. And in that dialogue, it tells you which characters should say which things. So have you been using design AI to make your videos? Because if not, we've got questions. Then another way to do this is to use the lip sync function. And you can click here to choose both the characters' faces. 
and then in here you can create the audio for each character in this option here when you use Spanish sounding male for the man I'm going to copy and paste his dialogue into the box here and then click generate then you can adjust this on the timeline to where you want it to be length of the video so now I can create the audio for the female detective then need to line up the audio on the timeline to the right place and listen to how it sounds so have you been using design AI to make your videos because if not we've got questions I'm happy with that so I click confirm and then on the left hand side I click generate so have you been using design AI to make your videos because if not we've got questions so whether you're making short films ads or animated stories having consistent characters are part of the sequel of having people really buy into the story and now with design AI you could do it with up to three characters at once we both know you were there tell us the truth you're running out of time to cut a deal. No mismatch faces, just perfect consistency scene after scene. Drop a comment below and let us know how you will use this tool. What kind of stories will you tell with multiple consistent character generation? And if you like more tools, tips and tutorials on the design platform, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification so you don't miss the next one.